Hey guys, it's Lex. Welcome back to my channel. If you're not already, go ahead and click the subscribe button down below and give this video a big thumbs up because I post weekly videos. So I'm really excited for today's video because I've had this package and I've been waiting to unbox it on camera and set it up with you guys. And it's a mini skincare fridge. I've wanted one of these for so long and I finally just bit the bullet and ordered one off of Amazon. This one is by the brand Kululi. It was $49.99 on Amazon and I also saw it on Urban Outfitters, I think for around the same price, but sometimes Urban Outfitters has like beauty sales and stuff like that. So I posted on my Instagram if you guys wanted to see just what's in my skincare fridge or kind of a combination of unboxing it, setting it up, and then showing you guys also what's inside. So you guys wanted me to do the whole thing. So if you wanna see me unbox and set up my skincare fridge, let's get right into the video. Okay, so I'm gonna move back a little bit so you could see what I'm doing. It's packed nicely in styrofoam. Oh my God. Oh, it smells like plastic. <laughs> Ew, it smells like fishy plastic. There's nothing else in the box, so I'm just gonna put that on the floor so it's not in the way. Oh, okay, so it's sideways, there we go. Oh my God, this is so cute, I'm so excited. So this is what the little fridge looks like. It has a cold and a warm setting. I'm not really sure why you would have a fridge on like a warm setting, I guess. Yeah, definitely gonna be using just the cold setting. So I don't really know the difference between these two plugs. This one looks more familiar to me. Oh, I wonder, maybe the plug is, the plug is probably inside here. Oh my God, it smells on the inside, why? Okay, we got our instructions, which I'm probably gonna read because I don't wanna mess this one up. And thank God it comes with its own plugs. So I Lysoled the box when it came in. I'm just gonna go get a Lysol wipe and wipe this down really quick because I'm gonna be putting skincare products and stuff that I use on my body and with like this whole thing going on, I'm just gonna be extra careful. So, and it kind of stinks a little bit. So I'm just gonna go get a Lysol wipe. Okay, so I think we're all sanitized and good to go. So I'm just gonna look at the instructions really quick to see if like there's a certain way to like plug it in, which thing I'm supposed to use. So it comes with all of these plugs. Um, not really familiar with this. This one looks like a normal plug that I would plug into the wall, so we're just gonna go for this one. Okay, moment of truth. Ah, little fan is going. I don't know what I'm like, what I expected to happen. I've never set up a fridge, let alone a mini fridge, so this is all new and exciting for me. Oh my God, it's already getting cold. It already feels like it's getting cold. Okay, so I'm gonna let this hang out and I will be right back when it is time to start putting my skincare products in here. Okay guys, so the fridge has been running now for about 20 minutes and it got really cold really fast. I could feel the condensation and it feels like ice cold. So yeah, I'm gonna start putting my stuff inside. I don't even know where to start. So the first thing that I definitely know that I want to put in my skincare fridge is the Milk Makeup Under Eye Cooling Serum because it's a cooling serum already and it feels nice when I put it on my under eyes but being in the little fridge having it be like ice cold is gonna feel so good and then this is a watermelon brightening serum stick I just feel like a cold like serum stick would feel so good on your face after a hot shower oh my god they look so cute in there another milk makeup product the hydro grip primer this is my favorite primer ever and it's a jelly if you ever used it before you know when it like comes out it's like a jelly almost like hair gel it's such a unique texture I wear this primer constantly I feel like if I put it in the fridge it'll get nice and cold and it'll feel really good on your skin but also coldness tightens your pores so putting on a cold primer I feel like if it tightens my pores makes them smaller before I put on my makeup that would be like key so I'm gonna throw this in here I feel like having that primer in the fridge might be game-changing so I will let you guys know in my next video what I think about that so the next thing I'm gonna put in there is my truly beauty doll skin cream and I use this as a daily moisturizer it almost feels like the Tatcha water cream in a sense that when it touches your skin it gets more watery it's not thick and like greasy so that's why I like to use this as a daily moisturizer I don't really know like what you're supposed to and like not supposed to put in the skincare fridge I can't imagine it getting so cold that it would like freeze anything so I feel like anything's kind of like fair game besides like maybe setting sprays and stuff So this is the glow recipe watermelon sleep mask I ordered stuff from Sephora online and this came as a free sample and I actually really like it So when I run out, I'm probably gonna order the full size of this But I don't know if you could tell but it has a really like 
jelly texture, kind of like the Milk Hydro Grip Primer. But I feel like this would be a nice cooling jelly sleep mask to throw in the skin fridge and put it on before bed. So these two serums by Truly Organic are my absolute favorite daily serum. I'm constantly switching on and off between the two, so I know that I'm gonna grab for them in the skincare fridge. So I'm gonna put these right in front. Those three Truly Organic products are like my holy grail every day. Come out of the shower, put on the serum, the moisturizer, no matter what. I don't know if you guys could tell, but I really like Truly Organic for my skincare. Not sponsored, they don't send me anything in PR like that, but I just really like their stuff. The ingredients are super clean, high quality, they're vegan, cruelty free, and I just love them. So yeah, I have the Erica Costell Gloat Collection. It's supposed to moisturize and help naturally plump your lips. A lot of it has like peppermint, like menthol-y, like tingly ingredients in it so I think that if it was like cold when I put it on it would feel really nice. I'm gonna try to fit this stuff somewhere. I wish it would fit right here. That would be nice but okay this fits in there. I just want to put something in here. This is the Derma E Overnight Peel Mask. I got that as a little sample when I ordered some lotions and stuff off of their website and it fits in here and I, I just want to put something in there, okay? This is the OC Malibu Atmosphere Protection Cream. I love this as well for a daily moisturizer. It's not greasy, kind of like the Tatcha Water Cream and the Truly Organic one that I told you guys about. So definitely one of my everyday favorites that I'm gonna put in here. Guys, I love how this looks, it's so cute. This is the Kalos Beauty Soothing Overnight Cream. Some of this stuff I kind of forget that I have and I use it when I get it and then I always go back to like my daily stuff. So I think this will be good that when I like open this up, I'll see everything that I actually have and like I'll use up some more of my stuff. This is a little mini Tatcha water cream that I got in a travel set from Sephora. I don't know if people put body lotions in here, but personally I don't think I want to because when I get out of the shower, I don't want to put like a cold lotion on my skin. I want to be like nice and warm and comfortable. So I think I'm just gonna stick with this stuff, what's in here right now. I really wish I had one of those like jade rollers or like gua sha. I think it's like that thing that you put on your chin and it moves around like the fluid and like the lymph nodes in your face. You're supposed to keep those in the fridge because the stones get nice and cold and they're good for your skin. So I think I'm gonna order some of those. I could put them in this cute little pocket right there because I think they'll fit. Ta-da! Oh my God, guys, I love this so much. It is so cute. I'm so happy that I got this. I've been like super into skincare lately, but this is gonna make me even more excited to do my skincare. I have quite a bit of stuff in here, but I think I could still even fit a few more things, which is nice because it is a tiny fridge. But... Okay guys, so I moved my little skincare fridge to her forever home and she's so cute. Look at her, look at her go. She's so cute. It fit perfectly in that little shelf, which I'm so happy about. Okay, I think I put everything in my skincare fridge that I possibly could at the moment. The only thing is, I will say it does make a noise. Like, I don't, I don't know if you could hear that. It's like a very, very faint like humming of like a fan. I don't think it's gonna bother me when I'm sleeping or anything like that. You could also like put this in your bathroom as well, but I don't think my parents would be too happy about me putting a mini fridge in their bathroom. That's like the only, I would say like negative if that bothers you. So thank you so much for watching this video today. Also, thank you so much for 300 followers on Instagram and 100 subscribers here on YouTube. I know those numbers are really small compared to everything else that's out there, but I really appreciate it so much. I've been working so hard so everyone's support means so much to me so thank you so much if you didn't in the beginning go ahead and click the subscribe button down below turn on your notifications so that you get notified every time I post a weekly video as always thanks so much for watching stay happy stay healthy stay safe and I can't wait to see you in my next video